Right, hello folks. I just thought I'd um, do a little sort of chin wag with you. When I'm uploading lots of work on, on the sort of main two foot by four foot board. Oh, here you go. Um, sorry, quick, quick flash for the old British Legion. On that, what I'm on about. But um, I'm doing lots of updates on the, the battle board. The, well, the centre board for my game of belt action that I'm going to have. Well, I thought I'd just have a little, a little bit of a chin wag and an update on things in general with you. I mean, this is just something I'm working on. About. This is my scout element, about part of my scout element for um, belt action. And there's a few bikes that Waterloo seven four five. I think it's seven four five. Certainly, I just call it Waterloo. You know what I'm on about anyway, the lawyer. I don't know if you've ever seen this little chap. And if he looks a bit familiar to you, have a good look. And he came through the post one day for me. It's a little obstinate fear of dread, lad, that Waterloo did for me. I don't usually bring him in here, he's usually in the but of um, with the precious things on my shelf in my Marvel miniature collection. I just thought I'd flash him off while I got the rest of the bikes out and then we're going to put back somewhere safe. So, um, I just thought I'd show you bits and bobs while working out. I mean, they're the foundry ones, which are pretty cool. They're the bowl touching ones, which are a lot more pieces of bowl touching ones on, they're slightly bigger. I think these are more like a Zundap. They look a little bit more like a Zundap, but the old BMWs that look like that, and these ones are definitely the BMW sidecar. But not not bad little little models. Kind of nice fun to have a nice little motorbike element. That's a figure I'm working on for Waterloo's competition. Just going to finish him off soon. But anyway, in general, back to what I was on about. Um, a little update on things to come. I've got some, I'll do a couple of unboxings on a few bits and bobs I've bought for bolt action. I'll do those. But I have had a few requests in for build stuff, which is um, and a little request on basically stuff that people have seen me using, like on a Dremel. So I will, I will do a little video on an overview of a Dremel. I mean, they're very straightforward, so it might be a really quick one at all try and show people the tools that I've got with it and just how you put it together and stuff but it will be a very quick one because I think that's all it justifies they're, they're very straightforward tools to get your head around which you've been showed once and showed the bits and bobs but I have had some requests to make other styles of buildings I like, I mean I apologise that I've been um, kind of just World War 2 because that's what I'm kind of doing at the moment I mean I have got some other, other interests other gaming interests like, but I kind of like sort of take the bit by the teeth and um, work on one project solid until it's finished and then I won't, I won't really deviate but I will get the, um, the, the the Normandy farm finished and I will do a couple of sh short videos like totally random on builds like I'll do some Wild West stuff I've got a few bits and bobs I will make a Wild West build it very basic one very quick one just to show you how I'd sort of go about it and I will do a video of the ancient Germanic huts that I built. Very quick one, very straightforward one, because there's a few about now. But I'll just do it how I do it and do it from A to B. And I will I will inject them as soon as I um, get a chance to do other stuff. But um, I do take notice of anybody asking me what they want to see and requests and stuff. So please do ask, like, and as soon as I get a chance, I'll... Um, and get around to putting them into film content and banging them on in a little section. So I've got a lot of Wild West stuff I want to paint, so I will probably get some bits and bobs of that knocked up at some point. So anyway, um, if you're looking for the sites that are kind of like mine, just check um, the featured sites and bullet underneath. And I've been putting a lot of people's sites on there that I like and I find interesting. And um, predominantly, um, they're just good good lads and. 
um, if you've got any questions and like anything that's on their sites just go ask them I think you'll find them very welcoming so just just take a look because that's when I'm kind of adding things now I'm not going to do show tapes very often because I, I never remember everybody so I'm just going to start adding people to my featured list so just keep checking out their sites because there's some good quality work there and uh, as I come across your sites I'll be adding you to my featured list now, it's, now you can put more people on which I kind of find a lot better but anyway I'm enjoying everybody's work at the moment and take care of yourselves lads and speak to you all soon